Here at Still Metal Farms, National Alpaca Farm Days are in full swing, the purpose being to educate those who are interested about the alpaca lifestyle. However, Still Metal Farms was not always dedicated to alpacas, as Sylvie Remingall, manager of the farm, well, explains. This farm used to be a horse farm, and Mrs. Brewster didn't want to do the horse anymore. So I used to work in Ireland. She asked me to come back to work for her. But we didn't want to do anything we are going to be slaughtered. With. There's no way this was going to work. So we kind of look around. Uh, I knew the alpaca from my experience in Australia. So we kind of said, okay, let's see what's going on with the alpaca in this country. And we just went from there. Alpacas are tame, easily cared for animals. Grooming is nearly non-existent as rain will wash off dust and straw and only being shown once a year. Even for competitions where alpacas are judged on their fleece quality, a bath is not required. To judge the fineness, a few fibers are pulled from as close to the body as you can get and are placed upon another fabric. If the fiber stands out, it is less fine than one that is harder to detect. Because of these thick fleeces and only being shorn once a year, alpacas need nothing more than a shelter to get them through the winter and a fan or two in the summertime. From Still Metal Farms, this has been Marley McHugh for Fox 61 Student News, signing out.